the Nintendo Switch has a 6.2 inch screen that might be a little small if you commonly play local multiplayer on the go. I have a solution for that and that's this portable monitor by Leepow. They were nice enough to send me a free unit for review. We're gonna open it up, see what's in the box, how it interfaces the Nintendo Switch. This monitor also works with your phone, your laptop, PlayStation 4, Xbox. A fairly nicely packaged box here. On the back, we have the specification. So this is a 15.6 inch Type-C portable display. In addition to USB Type-C, it also supports HDMI input. It does have built-in speakers, but if you want, you could use the 3.5 millimeter jack for external speakers. Interesting that this company also has a toll-free number that you could call for support. The resolution on this is 1080p, so full high definition. Of course, it's not 4K, but 1080p should be good for almost all your portable uses, especially with the Nintendo Switch. Inside of the box to the right here is a USB-A to USB-C cable and that of course is used to power the monitor along with this AC adapter. Here's a screen protector, it's nice that they actually throw that in the package. And you can register the product to get three and a half years of warranty. And an interesting way for them to get you to review the product. So it says here that you get a gift card, although it doesn't really mention how much the gift card's for. But hopefully it's worth the five minutes it takes you to drop a review. Next up is the monitor itself, which comes in this smart cover. Now, before I detail the monitor, the other two items in the box are a USB Type-C to Type-C cable. So this you can use for your Nintendo Switch or your smartphone and an HDMI cable, which you can use on a number of devices like your PlayStation 4, your Xbox, your laptop. And I almost forgot, it also comes with a user guide. The monitor is about 0.3 millimeters thick and it weighs just under two pounds. The cover is actually heavier than the monitor. Before I use this, I should remove the packaging and put on the screen protector. And here it is, I, I did a pretty bad job of putting the screen protector on. You can see there's a ton of bubbles. The smart cover of course protects the monitor when you're traveling, but it also functions as a stand. To use this with the Nintendo Switch, plug it into an external power supply. So that can be a power outlet in your home. Or if you wanna go completely portable, know that this monitor operates at low voltages. So you can simply use an external power bank such as this one, which you should be able to get for 10 to $15 from Amazon or eBay. Plug in the provided USB-C cable, one end on the monitor and the other end on your Nintendo Switch. Now this process completely takes out the dock. And here you can see you're actually also charging your Nintendo Switch. And the rest is simple, do what you normally do, take out the Joy-Cons and enjoy some multiplayer gameplay on a bigger screen. And just to clarify, because I know most of you are wondering, what about the Nintendo Switch Lite? And I'm, I'm sorry to say, there's no way you're gonna get a Nintendo Switch Lite on a bigger screen. It's not gonna work here. The Switch Lite just does not have the internal hardware to supply an output signal via this USB port. But still, you can use this monitor for a ton of other uses. You can plug your phone into this thing and interestingly, in that case, it powers itself from your phone. So it's truly portable in that sense. You don't need access to electricity. Same thing if you use a laptop. It will power itself from the laptop. You can use it as an extra screen with your laptop. And because it has an HDMI input, you can use other gaming consoles like a PlayStation 4 or Xbox One. So I know you're all wondering how much does this thing cost? It's $155 right now if you use a coupon. 
I have a link in the description below, so feel free to check it out if you need a light and cheap portable display to carry around wherever you go. The build quality is actually really good. It has good functionality. Of course, keep in mind, I've only had this thing for less than a week, so I can't speak for how long it's actually gonna last before it breaks down. However, the card that it comes with does say three and a half years warranty, so I have my fingers crossed. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's all I have for today. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Leave your comments below on what you think of this product. Do you think something like this is actually worth the $150, $155? Or am I just trying to sell you a lemon here?